Hi folks, this month I want to share a particular problem that I've got with my caravan. Now, many of you, including myself, you go and spend 50, 100 grand on a brand new caravan, and what's really disappointing is that they include one of these jockey wheels. Now, they work 80% of the time, but trust me, as in my case, it's gonna let you down. So my problem is with this jockey wheel that came with the caravan, is it seems to work okay, but every time I hitch up, I've got to take the thing off, store it in the car or toolbox or in your caravan somewhere. When you get to your destination, you've got to put it back on. There are several pro problems with this. One is these jockey wheels just don't have the travel, both up or down. So what people, including myself, tend to do is you lift this thing up all the way saves you putting it into the car and you travel like that and in my case have a look i hit a speed bump and i bent the block in so in doing my research there was a lot of jockey wheels on the market that could kind of work i didn't want to swing away jockey wheel i had a look at what some of the top end queensland caravan manufacturers were using and this is it this is the arc center mount jockey wheel one solid piece of gear it comes either with double wheels or a plate i'm going to go with a plate because it gives me even more clearance this thing was engineered by our corporation in australia here it's manufactured for australian conditions this thing is really awesome look at the adjustment so i can raise or lower the jockey wheel adjustment and then start unwinding that's 900 mil of travel in total this is unheard of in a jockey wheel it has servicing grease points the handle comes on and off so um yeah let's give it a go and uh, get it onto my van and see how it works so it's off with this thing and well, I'm going to show you how easy it is to fit the center of a jockey wheel. All uh, you need is the jockey wheel, you need two U-bolts and a 19mm spanner. The jockey wheel is pre-drilled, so you can mount a variety of most common crossbars on your A-frame here. So all you do, place it on there, insert your U-bolt. Put on your second bunch of nylons just tighten the nylon as you can see the actual bracket sits on the crossbar here so it's taking all the weight need to be too tight but so that's the center mount jockey wheel fitted now if you come around here have a look underneath that is a wheel fully raised and have a look underneath. I've got 100% clearance. I'm not gonna hit any speed bumps. And when I get to my destination, I've got a release mechanism here. I can lower the jockey wheel, no matter what height, and then use this handle very easily to raise my caravan for hitching or unhitching. And as you can see, this has about 900 mil of travel, right? So it'll get you in and out of any situation. Unlike the previous jockey wheel, which barely had 400 millimeters. And I got stuck on several occasions trying to hitch and unhitch and undulating ground when free camping. So as you can see, when I'm ready to go, I hitch up, raise this all the way. release the lift mechanism and that's it it's a hundred percent out of the way you can even take this magnetic handle off and store that or you can permanently leave it on there it has a strong magnet it shouldn't fall off so i'm going to give this a go now and see how it works on some uh, hilly and undulating ground all right so you come to your camp spot and I've deliberately just chosen very undulated ground here. So you can see there's, the car's quite high up and the caravan's down in the valley, which is gonna make it quite a challenge for any jockey wheel. So let's see what we can do. 
So as you can see, the jockey wheel is out of the way, nicely sitting there in the middle. And I've come up onto this undulated ground. So as you can see, my jockey wheel is, has been stored high up. Huge gap between my drawbar and I've got to get a huge lift to get this drawbar off my uh, car to unhitch. So I'll just drop this, undo my DO35 and start lifting. Always remember, leave your chains on while you're doing this. Put your handbrake on. Leave your chains on in case your caravan decides to run away. And as you can see, I've got heaps of lift here. There we go. This would have been quite challenging for a normal jockey wheel. You can see now how high I had to raise my A-frame to unhitch the van. There's no way a standard jockey wheel would be able to do this. I've unhitched my van. Now the challenge is, has this got enough play to come down and lower the van, which a normal jockey wheel would not have. So quite easy to do. You've got almost, in this case, about 600 mil. And I could go further, but that's probably good enough now. Summary folks, this is an ARC center mount jockey wheel. The best jockey wheel in the market by far. If you've got a heavy van like this and you go off road or situation with unhitching or hitching, this thing is amazing. It'll just get you out of any situation. It feels very sturdy. It's not any heavier than your standard jockey wheel that you're replacing. Looks the piece. So ARC center mount jockey wheel. You can't go wrong. It's a great piece of gear.